Hey guys, John Lux here, back with our blind playthrough of Corpse Party. Uh, so, I have everything ready-ish this time. So now we're still going for some of the extra endings. We're doing, looks like, ending 3, and then uh, 8, 9, and 10, because I think that's 10. Yeah, alright, so, number 3, and let me just uh, skip to this real fast. Um, right, so, whoop, that's, that is it, but that's not what we want yet. Oh, there's Jack. Could you, you know, oh, no, not on the keyboard. Don't step on the keyboard. I love you, but don't step on the keyboard, okay? All right, you. I'm going to try and get you in my lap. You know, I just, I, I just fed them too, so they should not be, they just want love. They want love, is what they want. I don't know if, can you see him? He's right here. Would you like to get in my lap? Here, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on, come on, or don't. How about don't then? All right. <laughs> Listen, if I, if I don't grab you, you're gonna... Go sniff my drink then. Fine. Just, could you move? Maybe editing would... Do oh oh you oh you you cat where are you where are you going I was gonna put you in my lap and then he runs off what a dork what a dork <laughs> I can't even pronounce my words correctly he has two first names all right so basically the goal is to do what do we have to do. I think we got everything here. And... Got everything here, we gotta go back over here, and then... I don't... I don't know what exactly should I... Let's... let's, uh... Check the guide again real fast. Okay, where did we leave off? Uh... Yuka... Yoshiki chooses to go back, go downstairs, move towards the center. Leave the custodian's closet, go east. Uh, read the notes, go west until Sakushi, blah, blah, blah. Return to the entry entryway, examine Yuka, return to the main building, and switch to a Yumi. Mm, I don't know if we necessarily have to, but... Uh, it's, ooh, a little bit, a little bit of slowdown little bit of slowdown first and then it picks back up as as normal so I guess we can we could follow wait did we use this lever before I ah, will switch okay so we already read this I believe and then I believe there should be another one somewhere and then using that lever I think opens some passageway again the goal is to get to the science lab and get oh now now Manny's in the way so first Jack you could see his head there for a second Manny cat would you so first Jack now Manny but at least Manny will lie down in my lap okay are you gonna are you gonna get in my lap you weirdo Okay, we'll, we'll come on then. Come on, there we go, there we go, okay. Lay down my cute, oh, okay. I love you, yes I do. All right, let's. <laughs> oh, my children, they're like, dad's home. We've been working more than, uh, not more than normal, but it's starting to become like pre-pandemic levels. E even though we're actually dealing with virus patients as well. Okay, is this something that we want to do? Um... Maybe. I mean, that was... That was something, right? Uh... 
Uh, go to the entryway and examine the notebook. Yeah, okay. Go to the second floor. Uh, examine the loose pages. Return to the first floor. Examine the third set of notes. Switch to Satoshi. It's just... I could wander around, but it will ultimately, I think, be faster if I do... The guide. Is this... This is Naho's... I think... Right. Um... I think that was over here, near the first classroom. But I mean, you know, I could I could wander around on my own, but it'll ultimately ultimately be faster if I follow the guide. Here we go, number two. The house notes, two out of five. And that's where we just were. Right. So we're going to read those, and then I think we switch back to Satoshi. We pull some lever, presumably to allow access somewhere. Naho's notes three. Right. Science lab. Not unlocked, sort of, but you know. Alright. Let's save. We'll save over this. Alright, we're gonna switch to Satoshi. We have to pull some lever, which presumably is this one, but maybe not. That is maybe near the science lab. That could be right. Let's check. Okay. Ch -ch -ch -ch. Third set of notes. Switch to Satoshi. Go up to the second floor. Use the lever. Switch to Ayumi. All right. Uh, and then this is step 11. Examine the blood in the science lab. Then enter. Examine the fourth set of notes. Try to leave. During the attack, avoid the anatomical model. Get the key. Then escape the room. Now, for third ending three... Get caught by the anatomical model or Yoshikazu. Uh, when in control of Yoshiki, use the gas burner on the model, matches her in the space heater, or get caught by Yoshikazu again. Continue with Ayumi and Satoshi's segments as usual, which is weird. All right, where? It's not here. No. Uh, you're my kitten. You're my kitten, Manny. You and Jack are both babies. All right, I think it's this way. No, it's not. I thought wrong. But yeah, work's been more, more than normal. You want to smell my drink? You smelled it already, though. It tastes good, but it's more of that $3 vodka mixed with uh, pineapple juice. We'll save here again. Do we want... Oh, there's the blood. Do we want to get the key or whatever that is? Blood. What are you doing, Manny? <clears throat> you see him kind of... Oh, that's the tail. Would you like to lay down again instead of getting up? All right, we're gonna get caught by the anatomical model. 
Mocha pointed out this might be um, Kizami, which is interesting. Looks like a really big dude with a sheet over his head, but it couldn't be, could it? Uh, just an anatomical model. Yeah, you used to be able to donate your body to science and actually be like a, like a skeleton in a lab. Alright. Right. Well, there's no matches over there, as far as I know. Still in the same place. Probably nothing happens till you read the notes. Uh, I want to feel you stroke my hair. The head pat. Right, notes number five. And it's moved. Okay, so we have to get caught twice. Get caught twice. Hey. Hmm? We're gonna listen for the voices. Oh, yeah, there you go. Trying to kill us. All right, well, in that case, I guess we could probably get caught, right? Let her go, you bastard. Good. So I guess it grab it was grabbing her by the neck. No, no. Shinozaki. Shinozaki. God damned. Kurt, he's just getting. Move, you asshole. So I assume I don't actually know what's happening here. It's entirely possible. It's possible the thing is, like, knocking him down, or it's possible that he's trying to, like, punch it, and it's so tough he's just getting, like, knocked back. And presumably that's not wide enough. The gap above and below is not wide enough to actually go around. But, I mean, if it's got reach, it's got reach, you know? Yeah. Stop it. What? Stop it. Stop what? Pant wheeze cough. Oh, stop it, please. Just leave me. Run. Get out of here. Shinozaki, don't worry. I'm gonna save you. You're just gonna die. Look at you. You're bleeding badly. You know, she's not trying to escape or anything. She's just sitting there. Like, maybe... Oh, and there's uh, Yoshikazu right over there. Right? I mean, it's like, you could try to escape too, Ayumi. You, you're you just watching him getting his ass kicked, and you're not doing anything. There's an order from your class rep. Leave me. Oh, just shut it. Don't give me that crap. I'm not Satoshi. But I'm going to protect you anyway. Damn, if this keeps up, I'm a goner. There's got to be some way. I see. Empty. What if I... The door's open. Well, we're going for ending three, though, so... Uh, we could get caught. Or... Right, one of the things was burn it, right? When in control, use the gas burner on the model matches are in the space here. The gas burner is on top of one of the tables. Or get caught by Yoshikazu. Let's try burning it. Oh yeah, box of matches on the ground next to it. Take them. Sure. 
And, well, we might not have much of a choice. Yoshikazu might be... Gas burner, that's it! Either way, it might have the same outcome. Eat this! There you go. Yeah. And Yoshikazu ran. It does look really messed up, though. Like the skin is all ripped off. You jerk, you dumbass. Shizaki. <laughs> Glad to see you're still in one piece. Did I read her lines? You idiot, you dumbass. You stupid, uh, I hate you so much. Women. <laughs> Sob, ball. Sounds like a happy cry to me. Guess that means you're okay. Don't die. Don't die, damn it. <sighs> this... Use the gas burner or get caught by Yoshikazu. How does... How are the outcomes the same? Right? Is that what it said? Get caught by the anatomical model. When in control, use the gas burner on the model. Or get caught by Yoshikazu. Optional return to the science lab for a small bonus scene. Hmm. I don't... I don't know how this... How getting caught by Yoshikazu ends with the anatomical model getting destroyed. It might not even be destroyed. You just burn the sheet off. Don't die, damn it. All right, all right, all right. Just stop crying, Shinozaki. I want to see you smile. I love your smiling face most of all. Ichiban ski. Ichiban ski. Uh huh. Oh! Okay. That'll do it. Ah, uh, no. Shinozaki, run, run. Yeah, because it's not dead. It was on fire and it's like killing him while it's probably burning him. No, no, no. And I wasn't advancing any of that text. It was just going on its own. So... Well, ask and ye shall receive, I suppose. All right, uh, let's see. Uh, continue with the Yumi and Satoshi segments as usual. So she might still be alive. And I can still click on that. Right, so let's... Um, So partially, we're going to wander around. I guess, right? So we should be locked into ending three. Now the question is, are we going to do something that will cause us to automatically switch to her, right? To be done with our, to be done with our section. Right. Fall into the bug pit. That could be one. Uh, well, we haven't opened that yet. Yuka, can I have know. that tape you found? Okay. I'm sure we've seen this before. Broken breathing. Should be alone. Can't die here. If anyone's watching this tape, here's what the way out is. She's never done it. How could you? How could you? <laughs> Sensei! Sensei! Ooh. No, no! This sounds like someone's trying to get in, like the doors can't give it any moment. Just go through the closet in the back of the room, yeah. Are we gonna see Naho? 
Yeah, okay. And honestly, the sensei should have been a giveaway anyway. If, if we were Japanese, we probably would have picked up on that. Maybe, I'm sure other people did. They're like, sensei, what? But I didn't, because I'm a dumbass. I was going to say doofus, and then my brain switched to dumbass, like, right before I started speaking. I'm like, do, 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 mas. <laughs> oh, silly brain. It was a ceiling tile, but it missed me. Oh. Yep, taken in this room. Oh, yeah, 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 and that, like, uh, darkened. Yep. The smell of decay. Yep. And the girl with him is wearing the same uniform as that spirit. Why are they both in the closet, though? Right? Like, who put them there? Okay. In the back wall. Watch the two bodies. Oh, Naomi, you're so kind. <laughs> Where are we? It smells awful. So is this going to be the... So she goes up there. I re I'm really curious about if... Let's, let's, I'm curious about this one. Go first or send Yuka ahead. Uh, okay, I'm gonna... Let's see. Right, these are the asterisks. Return to classroom, go to 3F, enter the reference room. Switch to Satoshi, go to Custodian's closet. Choose either option. Okay, so it appears that it doesn't matter. I think before I went first, I'm going to send Yuka ahead this time. Yeah. No! Look, what if something suddenly attacks you while you're down here all by yourself? I've seen your underwear plenty of times before. There's no reason for you to go bashful about it. There is today! Fine, have it your way. I'll call down when I reach the top. And when I do, you come right up after me, you understand? Uh-huh. You come at the top. Okay, Naomi, where'd you go? Satoshi. Mm. Okay, we'll, we'll advance this. Is this where he shows her the texts? Yes. And then Yuka, Yuka took a long time to climb the ladder, but that's okay. Alright, feeling a little better. The tape. Received tape from Yuka. Right, so Yuka... I think somewhere in the guide was like, only give... Was this guide? It was maybe the other guide. It was like, you only pick up the ones that you need so you don't screw up which, uh, which items to give. But if this is the sin tape... That gets you a bad ending if you give it to Sachko, so... Although maybe you have to get it, because that's what Naomi watches of her killing Seiko, so... I guess it makes sense that Yuka found it, because it ensures that the story keeps going. Alright. I have mine. Oh yeah, I've got mine right here. I lost my thing. Okay. Okay, we're gonna find it together. Um... Do I... Go anywhere, or what do I do here? Do I go this way? I cannot go that way. I could go here. Nothing in here, presumably. I don't know why it's 
why I skipped that one, but I did. Let us, let us switch then, unless we're supposed to go, I don't know. Oh no. Is that where we're supposed to meet up? Mochida Nakashima. Oh, that's a Yumi saying the stuff. What happened to you? You're covered in scratches. What if I would have done it from a different spot? Would we still have this conversation? You know what I mean? What if I'd switched to the pentagram? Would it just have teleported me here? I, I don't know. What happened to you? You're covered in scratches. Mm, Kishinuma, he... So, Yoshiki. Kishinuma, Kishinuma. When he put his mind to it, that idiot can really pull his weight. Only problem is nobody can thank him for what he did anymore. God damn it. Come on, we'll go nuts if we just stand around here. We have to keep moving. Try not to let yourselves get too upset, though. I mean, of course you'll be upset, but if you leave yourselves too vulnerable, that'll just be... That'll be just the opening this place needs. The darkening will take you over and you'll become part of the building like a stain. That's what Mr. Kabiki wrote, anyway. Okay. Yes. So let's keep looking for Miss Yui. As soon as we find her, we can get the hell out of here. Interesting. I know where that one was. But first... Reference room, door is locked. We want to try going back to... Who is this sad music? Kind of, yeah. Student ID name tag. Oh, I see. Oh. You got... Oh, no, okay, so the one on the... Oh, dude. Three piles, three piles of ash or whatever. The one right below the desk is, well, you can kind of see it. It's the, the anatomical, the anatomical model. It's just the sprite is turned black. You know, it's of, of it lying on its thing and the two eyes and the face. And uh, the other two to the lower left are presumably Yoshiki's body and his head separated that's no good yeah don't be sad manny and then she just runs out that's understandable and the door closes and locks well let's switch to um Switch to you, I suppose. I vaguely remember doing this. This one opens that. When are you supposed to get the marble statue? I don't even know if that's possible at this point. Maybe it is. Where was... Where was the fifth one? Do we want to read the fifth one? The fifth one was in the classroom, right? Hang on a second. Um, 
continue with the Yumi and Satoshi segments as usual. It doesn't really say much. I guess we'll find out. Oh, slow down. Is this what we want? Should I save? Should I save first? Let's save first. Just to be on the safe side. I don't expect it'll actually change much because I think reading the final set of notes changes the ending and I think we've already more or less locked in the ending that we're gonna get um yeah we'll save over this oh manny you're so cute you know on the other hand wait where am i Let's go read the final set of notes, because before, that's where you got the key to the reference room, right? Or, or not. Let's just keep going this way, I guess. We will find out one way or another. Room. What's happening? Am I trapped in here? Somebody open the door. Shimzaki. Come on over here. There's nothing to be afraid of anymore. Really is you. Right, they're standing on the trap floor at the moment. Put my arms in bad shape. Come on, stand up. We're getting out of here. There they go. Quickly. Oh, ah, uh, Mishishido, Mishishido. Oh, they just both fall in. Come on, you're almost there. Grown wheeze strain. Grab my hand. No, don't. Uh, floor collapse. Uh, Shizaki. He's strong. I hate this so much. I'm going to give you a motivational speech. You could be pulling me up at this time, but you're not. You bitch. <laughs> Okay. Well, uh, yeah. And now what? Because before they found Yuka's. Ah. One of the... One of the bad endings is losing to this, right? Let's find out real fast. Okay. Um... Mm-hmm. Okay, 8, 9, and 10. Skip the steps marked for 8. Is... Potentially just... That. If you don't get the final set of notes or enter the reference room, maybe I get the ending 8. Oh, I see. In step 17, let the timer run out for ending number 10. Step 17 is probably the bugs. Yep, okay, bug pit. All right, we're going to let the timer run out and get a wrong end. What the hell? La slimy bug lake. Right. Only a minute. 
Right. That's bad. That's... Oh! Really? No, she ends up somewhere else, right? That's right. I don't understand that, but okay. I think we're pretty close to getting out. Oh, no, we can't go that way. Am I not? Okay, we are... I can't last much longer like this. I don't know if I go up or if I have to go left or right or up or whatever, but I'm gonna let the timer run out because that's kind of what I want to happen. We're almost there. Ah, uh, gasp. No, save me. Yeah. Can't gasp. It hurts, it hurts. God, it hurts. Yeah, getting eaten alive is bad. A large number of bugs have found their way... Uh, wait, what? A large number of bugs have found their way onto my skin and have begun not only shuffling, shuffling across my body, but burrowing into it as well. Ah, uh, God, God, why? Make it stop. Save me, please. Satoshi gurgles. No... Okay, well that's, you know. That's fair. <laughs> that's, yeah. Alright, what are we at? Okay, good. It's only eight, three, eight, and nine. Let's continue from... here. All right, where are we going now? Are we going... So, okay, hang on. So, ending nine is... Looks like you run from the room in the science lab, right? So you leave... You mean, it's like, run, 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 and you run. Yoshiki runs. And then continue as normal. Um, hmm. Missing any without getting another ending. What about all these other stars? I don't know. Hmm, I guess we'll see. Let's just uh, switch to these. We'll get through the bug thing. Assuming we can. There we go. All right. It would be nice if we could get the time loop ending like from this. All right, help Satoshi. All right, uh, right. Feel all of them. Am I going the right way? No. I mean, kind of. Oh, there we go. All right. All right, she is out. We are good, and he's walking on his own. Alright, well, we are now across. I assume the fact that it collapsed means we cannot link up and get... Oh, that was weird. You're hearing the rain from outside, presumably. Means we can no longer link up and get the statues, I guess. Or does it? Don't know. Uh, let's save.
We'll save here. Right, I don't know what I need to do, but let's skip the... We might have to go across to the, um, the second wing, which is weird. Guess we'll see. <sighs> All right, then Yui, then. Then she leaves. That is done. Now I guess we go... somewhere else. Let's try going over here. That was kind of the trigger before. Oh no, it was up after coming out of the custodian's closet. Uh, what does it say? Absolutely no reason to, to return to that room ever. What if you need food, man? Bugs are supposedly full of protein and stuff. Any reason to come over here? Oh. Huh? Oh, yeah, okay. What the hell do we just see? Leaked. Oh, that's right. Wait, what's that? It's a key. We gotta get the key. Alright, you got the key, man. Good job. That's right, I forgot about that. So now, we are... Going to the principal's office. Right? I think that's where we're trying to go. Lots of save points. That is good. I don't really understand why the darkness right there, but... Alright, there is a scene. Okay. Yeah, yeah, she's the one at fault. What is this? Desk drawer is locked. Open the key. What is it? Oh, this is the tongue, right? Oh, yeah, and then... All of that. Alright, acquired the tongue. And then we... I think at this point we basically have to... Like, we don't have another option. You have to hit the switch to find the secret passage. And then you go into the secret passage, and that leads you... Okay. Thought there'd be something. Big brother have to pee. All right. Yep. Okay. Um. Right. Okay, yeah, yeah, All right. Lots of heads. Follow the friendly spirit. Two to the right. I think one to the left. Another two, no, one. Oh yeah, two to the right, okay. All right, two right, one left, two right. Why the, why the fake out though? I was really gonna be mad if you had to actually take like a step. 
Right, we need him. And then Naomi, she's like, here, here you go. And he sees her and he freaks out because she was the one that killed Seiko. But we don't know that at this point. Looked at my face and then he... We'll get we'll get some kind of ending. The question is which one at this point. Because it's you know making you go through a lot just to get a different ending. You know. But oh well. We still have three to go. Three endings. I wonder if it's going to be like basically the same ending, but Yoshiki is missing versus Ayumi is missing. And then the time loop one. I guess. I don't know. I was like, do I want to save? And the answer is... We don't have much of an option, to be honest. Do we go up? Do we go into the room? What do we do here? Oh, right, okay. I thought that was the... I thought that was the room with the... the buckets of blood. See. All right. I think I remember this one. It's like this, right? All right. Good job, Manny. Dissection room. <laughs> Smell. Where are you going, Manny? Don't go anywhere. What the hell is this room? What was it used for? Are we gonna check stuff out? Is that what we're doing? Hmm. I don't know why I can't click on the buckets. There. Oh, I guess there you go. Yep, footsteps are bad. Someone's coming. I don't... I don't think any of this would be different, but I don't know for certain. Right, okay. Okay, I'm gonna skip some of this then. That's Taguchi getting... No! Oh, yeah, 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 okay. I was like, is it not gonna show us Seiko's body?
That was really fast. I don't think it, uh, I don't think I, whatever. I was like, I don't think I, uh, forwarded that one, but. Yep, there's Taguchi. Found him in the cabinet, or cupboard. Okay, so Naomi is run off. All right, do we want to go? Like, I don't know if we're going to have to try and... Like, if we go to the right, do we get a bad ending? Stops here. Or is it going to tell me I'm not supposed to go this way? All right. Okay, so she, this is like her going into the incinerator room and somehow falling down in. What the where? Is she gonna find Yoshiki's body? Why are there so many bodies? Where the hell am I? Right, because before Yoshiki was like down in there and Shinzaki, Wachita and Yuku. Uh, I think we've read all that before. It's just with different... Whoa! Naomi, are you okay? Satoshi. Nakashima, you really had us worried, Pant Pant. Good to see you're uninjured, at least. Did you find Shinohara? Nakashima, I wish we could take Shinohara back with us, but I don't see any way that would work. The longer we stay here, the more likely it is that our way out will be closed. I think we should just leave while we can. I don't think we can bring back Shinohara with us. I wish we could. I hate to do it, but we really need to get out of here while we have the chance. Naomi doesn't have her paper scrap, though, I, I don't think. Okay. Alright, let's begin. Everyone gather around. Oh, they're just escaping here. Oh, I guess they skipped the part where she gets her paper scrap back. Sachiko, we beg of you. Sachiko, we beg of you. Sachiko, here, please. Sachiko, we beg of you. Sachiko, we beg of you. That's five. They're going back. That's good. I'm glad we're getting an ending this time. Wait, before you all go... Hmm? Don't stay home tomorrow. Come to school. Please. Okay. Shouldn't you could be going home with Satoshi? Satoshi. Also, I think the school name is in English right there. You can't tell, but... I couldn't sleep that night. My thoughts kept drifting back to Yoshiki. And not just him, but Miss Yui and the others, too. I never see any of them again. They were all just gone. Forever. I'd taken those carefree days we used to spend together for granted, and never realized how much they meant to me until it was too late. The night passed uncomfortably, and the next morning there was an incident involving Ayumi. She threw herself off the roof. She walked into the bathroom to wash her face, just like any other morning. But when she saw her reflection in the mirror, she froze in place. There, on her neck, was a large and clearly visible bruise, shaped very much like a pair of hands. Ah. She began scrubbing her neck furiously, trying desperately to wash it away. But all this did was make it darker and more apparent. With every pass of the towel, it's like the bruise somehow became a little more recent. She's, uh... I assume she bled to death. No. This didn't stop her though, and as she kept scrubbing, the bruise turned jet black. It absolutely absolutely looked like someone had strangled her. Ah! Uh, she screamed frantically, clawing at her neck like a madwoman, hoping in vain this was all some sort of mistake. She was clawing so hard her skin was peeling and bleeding profusely, and yet, even under the skin, the bruise was still there. It's very, uh, Higurashi. Like the whole when when they cry thing. 
Now firmly in a panic, she tried slathering the towel with soap and deeply rubbing it on, into her raw, bloody neck. Almost as if reacting to this, the entire area began to pulsate with a burning, suffocating heat. Oh. Yeah. Like the, um, the model, right? Ayumi still wouldn't stop rubbing the bloody, frothy towel against her skin, however, even with her body itself objecting to the act. The white block of soap had turned a deep crimson, and her consciousness was fading fast. Everything felt distant and unreal. But just as she was on the verge of blacking out, she heard her voice call out to her clear as day, and she recognized it immediately. What voice? Seiko? That's what happened. I feel like there's something lost in translation, and I don't mean like like the actual translation, I mean like a cultural thing that's missing. But oh, that's chapter three, so that's good. Oh, maybe it was your Shiki. That would make sense. Um, all right, two more endings to go. Hopefully we get them both next time. I, I honestly don't know, we shall see. Um, but like I said, that is it for today. Thank you guys so much for your time and attention. I really do appreciate it. I really hope these are still interesting to you guys. I know it's a lot of uh, going over the same stuff, but whatever. It's it's kind of, um, you know, it's it's a bit like hanging out. If I could be a little bit conceited in that respect. Um, still, I do hope you guys enjoy it. What is your guys' unique positive moment for today? For me, it's actually a, um... It's gonna be a weird one. I saw a dude, uh, part of a dude's testicles get amputated today. Uh, he had a, something called Fournier's gangrene, which is, uh... It's a complication of diabetes, it's where it actually attacks part of your, well, I think it's perineum is the term, but it's the, the taint, basically, right? The part between your your butthole and your your, or, your sex organs. Uh, it can affect women as well, but it seems like it affects men mostly. And apparently certain diabetes medications can actually uh, cause it somehow. Uh, <coughs> excuse me. Uh, but that's a reason to make sure you take care of your diabetes if you got it, or if you don't have it, don't get it. But, um... Kind of, uh, kind of fascinating. Gross, also, but... Kind of fascinating. So... That's my unique positive... Moment, I guess. Uh, still, it was... A learning... You know... Got to talk with the doctor about it, be like, what's, what is this? Talk, tell me about it, blah, blah, blah. So, that's my unique positive moment. Hopefully your guys is just as good, if not better. Hopefully better, of course. And I hope to see you guys next time. Until then, guys, take care.